When it comes to Jesus' death, the writers of the Gospels knew how important it was. They knew that if Jesus hadn't died, that there was no way to have a resurrection. And without a resurrection, there is no Christianity. And so they all went to great detail to tell us what they saw. And the interesting thing is, some of the things they saw tell us stuff that the guys who wrote it would never have known. Like, for instance, it says in John chapter 19, verse 34 and 35, that one of the soldiers pierced Jesus' side with a spear, bringing a sudden flow of blood and water. The man who saw it has given testimony. In other words, John, the one who wrote it, I saw it, and I'm telling you my testimony, and his testimony is true. He knows what he t that he tells the truth, and he testifies so you may believe. And so he's telling you very clearly what he saw, even if something is odd, like when they pierced Jesus' side, blood and water came out. Now, here's the interesting thing about that. John didn't know what was going on, but modern medical science does. Because when the spear is stuck into his side, had Jesus been still, still, still been alive, blood would have flowed out, but not blood and water. Modern medical science can tell us that when blood and water come out like that, it's something that only happens in death and only in certain types of death, like incredibly, incredibly stressful deaths, like, I don't know, somebody being beaten and tortured and then crucified. That would make the circumstances that are necessary for blood and water to flow separately out of an open wound in a dead body. So, Jesus was dead. He really died on that cross. We can take that to the bank. And if Jesus really died, then the testimony is very clear that he really rose from the dead. And if he really rose from the, de from the dead, then my faith is really real. And in a world that denies so many things, that one truth, Jesus really died and rose from the dead, changes absolutely everything. Take that with you throughout today and remind yourself, your faith is really real, not based on how hard you believe it, but on what really, really happened. And that's today's jump start.